It's currently underway for the primaries and election day is March 1st. One of the races on the ballot is for County Commissioner Precinct 4. KTSM 9 News reporter Shelby Cap spoke with the Democrats running for the seat. She joins us now. Well, Natasia, the Democratic candidates on the ballot for Precinct 4, which covers parts of West, Northeast El Paso, and Canateo, are current Precinct 4 Commissioner Car Robinson running for re-election. Now, his Democrat challengers include Dorothy Sissy Bird and Sergio Coronado. Now, Bird unsuccessfully ran for city council back in 2020, and Coronado unsuccessfully ran for county judge in 2010 and 2006. All the candidates for the Democratic primary talking about improvements needing to be done in Precinct 4 after the flooding we saw in 2021. Sergio Coronado saying it's going to be expensive, sharing his ideas of how to pay for it. Uh, there's an infrastructure bill now that just passed. We need to tap into that. The other issue is I think we need to make sure that the, that the state tries to help us. And the other thing is we can probably try and see if we can you know, explore uh, putting an extra tax on the license plates that are renewed every year on the vehicles. Dorothy Sissy Bird also talking about the need for improvements and how, if elected, she plans to pay for them. In November of last year, $1.2 trillion was um, designated for infrastructure. A lot of people misunderstand infrastructure. They think it only has to do with the roads. Well, it doesn't. It could do with schools. It could do with, uh, of course, the roads, buildings. So therefore, we need to make sure that we address those issues as far as applying for these grants. Robinson uh, talking about the new water pumping trucks in the county and the need for funding. Uh, we needed those, that type of equipment back in August. We have, now the county has four. It, on my insistence that we get the proper equipment for our workers. To, we have equipment to pump the water, but I'm working on getting funding so we can preclude the water from flooding it altogether. Both Coronado and Bird bringing up concerns about Robinson missing meetings. Our current commissioner has missed a lot of meetings. I don't think he's been engaged in the position. Robinson says he has missed some meetings, one because he was ill, but he says he has called in and joined in on Zoom before. So to say that I, that I just missed meetings, uh, no. Now there are also Republicans running for county commissioner seat for precinct four in the Republican primaries. Now we will hear from those Republican candidates later on this week. Natasia. Shelby, thank you. Two teens 